Hi everybody, on this episode I want to share what to eat in Japan and must try foods during your travel in Japan. If you like my videos, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and open notifications to be informed about new travel videos from all around the world. Japan is a country filled with delicious eats and Japanese street food is especially appetizing. Yattai are small food stalls that can be found along Japanese streets and at festivals and you don't want to miss out on the food they offer. These vendors offer an accessible and tasty selection of on-the-go dishes that are cheap yet high quality and delicious. Sushi is the most famous Japanese dish outside of Japan and one of the most popular dishes among the Japanese. Sashimi is a Japanese delicacy consisting of fresh raw fish or meat sliced into thin pieces and often eaten with soy sauce. Takoyaki are spherical Japanese dumplings are made from a savory butter filled with succulent pieces of grilled octopus, creating a combination of textures and tastes. Often referred to as octopus dumplings, takoyaki is not only a tasty snack but also an affordable treat that will leave you craving more. Using a specially designed spherical mold, the cooks expertly pour the butter, add the octopus pieces and deftly turn the dumplings with chopsticks until they are perfectly golden brown. Yakitori, a quintessential Japanese street food, consists of skewered meat expertly grilled to perfection. The dish is a staple in Tokyo and you can find it at countless food stalls and izakayas throughout the city. The smoky aroma, the sizzling sounds and warm glow of the grills create an immersive experience that's nothing short of magical. Okonomiyaki, a flavorful Japanese dish, has captured the hearts of food lovers not only in Japan but also in Western countries. In its core, okonomiyaki is a savory pancake that originated from the Japanese tradition of repurposing leftovers to create a scrumptious and satisfying meal. Okonomiyaki begins with a base of butter typically made from flour, water and grated yam. From there, an array of ingredients such as shredded cabbage, bamboo shoots, eggs, bacon, seafood and meat are added, creating a combination of flavors and textures. The dish is then cooked on the hot griddle right in front of you and served with a variety of toppings like nori, dried seaweed, pickled ginger, tonkatsu sauce, Japanese mayonnaise and bonito flakes. Dango are sweet rice dumplings often served on skewers and made from mochiko, a type of glutinous rice flour. These chewy, slightly sticky dumplings are then coated with various toppings or sauces such as sweet soy sauce, red bean paste or kinako, roasted soybean flour. At first glance, dango may not seem like the most appetizing treat. These round, sticky balls covered in powdery stuff can be quite intriguing to those unfamiliar with Japanese desserts. But once you take that first brave bite, you will soon realize that tango is a true gem among Tokyo street food. As the name suggests, these Japanese crepes are anything but ordinary. Crazy crepes are made from a thin layer of perfectly cooked butter, which is then filled an astonishing variety of sweet ingredients. From fresh fruits like strawberries, bananas, blueberries, kiwis and mangoes, to indulgent delights like whipped cream, matcha cake, chocolate sprinkles and ice cream. With so many combinations to choose from, you are bound to find a crepe that speaks to your taste buds and leaves you craving. Watame is essentially pre-baked cotton candy. 
As you stroll through areas like Ueno, you will find this airy, sugary confection waiting to satisfy your sweet tooth. Its soft, melt-in-your-mouth texture and sweet taste make Watami a popular and nostalgic treat for people of all ages. Tamagoyaki is a Japanese rolled omelette served on a stick and topped with various things like roe for example. Tamagoyaki can be found in places like the famous Tsukuji Market in Tokyo, where you can savor its delightful taste and silky texture. Tamagoyaki's irresistible taste has even inspired me to recreate the dish at home, making it a favorite morning meal or an easy, protein-packed snack throughout the day. No trip to Tokyo is complete without trying gyoza, the iconic Japanese dumplings that are crispy on the outside and packed with flavors on the inside. Gyoza come in a variety of fillings, with prawn gyoza being my favorite. These delicate dumplings are skillfully crafted with a thin wrapper, enveloping a juicy filling, then expertly pan-fried to create a perfect balance of crispy and tender textures. Onigiri refers to a popular Japanese snack made with white rice, nori and some type of filling. They are called rice balls though, they often come in triangular and cylindrical shapes as well. Typical onigiri filling include tuna, salmon, omeboshi, pickled Japanese plum, katsuboshi, bonito flakes, mentaiko, palokro, and kombu, kelp, though they can be filled with any salfi or sour ingredient that can be used as a natural preservative. Yaki tomorokoshi or grilled corn on the cob is a delightful Japanese street food that evokes fond memories of childhood and family traditions. This simple snack is perfect for enjoying while strolling through the streets of Tokyo or relaxing by the seaside as it brings together the comforting flavors of the corn with a distinct Japanese twist. Yaki tomorokoshi involves grilling corn on the cob, often served on a stick for convenient snacking. Shioyaki is seasoned mackerel with a generous amount of salt before grilling it over on an open flame or charcoal. When trying shioyaki for the first time, be prepared for the intensive saltiness and consider pairing it with a refreshing drink to balance out the flavors. One of the most satisfying and filling Japanese street foods has to be yakisoba. Yakisoba is essentially fried soba noodles stir-fried with a variety of ingredients including vegetables, meat or seafood. This bloat comfort food is perfect for enjoying outdoors whether you are sitting on a bench in Ueno Park or taking a break from exploring the lively streets of Tokyo. One important tip for enjoying yakisoba on the go is to master the art of using chopsticks. Since the dish can be a bit messy, being proficient with chopsticks will save you from turning your outfit into an impromptu yakisoba plate. Taiyaki is a delightful Japanese treat that combines artful presentation with a delectable taste. This fish-shaped cake is typically filled with custard, chocolate or savory cheese. They are one of my favorite Japanese desserts and I always crave them when I am back in Tokyo. The custard version is a popular favorite, but each filling offers its own unique and scrumptious experience. Kushikatsu is skewered and braided meat, seafood or vegetables then deep fried to achieve a golden crispy exterior. These crunchy skewers are typically served with a flavorful dipping sauce. Popular among both locals and tourists, kusikashu can be found in various street food stalls and izakayas across Tokyo, especially in the places like Yanaka Ginza. Kushikatsu can also be enjoyed in a restaurant that specializes in the dish. 
A hot lunch spot in the business districts in Japan, bento stands are super popular and usually sell out in a less than an hour. These colorful boxes of an assortment of meat, rice, and vegetables offer an easy and convenient method to consume multiple dishes from a one compact box. Pour yourself a cup of green tea and match on one of these delectable rice crackers. Senbei come in a plethora of sizes, shapes, and flavors. The crackers are usually baked or grilled and are enhanced with a soy sauce and mirin. If you like my what to eat in Japan and must try foods during your travel in Japan video, I would like to see your likes, comments and subscription to my channel for the new travel videos from all around the world. See you!